I was watching a video by Dr. Paul Enenche, and um, I'm saying this only because he said it. He was preaching this year at um, Bill Winston's ministry, and the Lord's Garden, the magnificent structure that they are building around the airport road in Abuja. And he said, just for the, the zinc alone, just to cover that place, they are spending 16 million US dollars. Zinc, not building. 16 million US dollars in a time of recession, debt free. Now, only a fool and a stupid person, 16 million dollars will more than answer the request of many ministries times 10. And this is what is used for zincing. So, a wise person says, This is the result I'm looking for. It is on earth already happening in someone's life so what do you do you follow them who through faith and patience what did he engage because he was not born like that as at 1999 god's servant dr paul and nature was in one room in abuja there were people who were in the houses they are still there today because they didn't engage anything as at 99 he was there with his wife in one room and all of a sudden rises to do something there are people still there today brothers and sisters if your life must change it's not up to god alone god's power is available i have indoctrinated myself into being a responsible believer that nothing will ever change just like that hallelujah what are you doing in partnership with the word of god do you understand the principle and the mystery that connects your challenge or your desire and the outcome do you understand then if yes are you engaging completely the future will show the mysteries and the things that koinonia is engaging is is not it's not something to blow trumpet and talk about now but the future will tell what is being engaged today. You see that? Something I do not know is responsible for where I am. Something I know but have not believed is also responsible for where I am. Something I have believed but have not acted upon consistently is responsible for where I am. While you are seated, can you pray, cry to God and say, Lord, I repent. I've been handing over the responsibility of my results entirely to you. But now I have heard you. I have seen it very clearly that nothing will change by itself. Are you praying? Some of you are looking at others. Forget about them and cry for your destiny. Apostle, I graduated since five years ago. Nothing has happened in my life. Show me what you are engaging first. Let me see what you have done. I thought I would have a job. Who told you you will have a job? Just like that? Show me the mystery you engage and the mystery you are engaging. Keep praying. Show me what you are engaging. Apostle, I expected that by now I should not be begging for food to feed my family. Show me what you are engaging. Or are you just waiting for things to happen? Show me. Apostle, I expected by now that my ministry should be strong enough financially. Show me what you are engaging. Let me see it. Apostle, I expected that by now I should be flowing at certain levels of the prophetic. Certain levels of the anointing. Show me what you are engaging sir i expect that i should be established by now i should have had a car and a house show me what you are engaging don't just wish for nothing i've been coming to church that's not enough what have you engaged pray nothing will ever change my brother my sister access to truth is not enough it must be engaged though access to truth is not enough apostle i've listened to all your messages on favor wonderful have you done
done what was said in the message consistently have you done what was said in the message